Man, is it cold. <laughs> hey, guys, first trip of 2018 is in the books. January 2nd, I had to get out there. I had to go get after it. Uh, ended up getting skunk out of, out of 2018 already. Only caught one fish, cast a thousand times. But, hey, it, it was worth it to me. At least I didn't come home skunk. It's been a, a good day, but, man, is it cold. And I've got a big old pot of deer chili at the house that I'm ready to go break off into. I wanted to talk to you real quick about why I'm back in the Coosa HD. Uh, for the 2018, there's not a whole lot of changes. You know, the hatches have changed. Uh, so we, we don't have the bungee, thank the Lord. It's got the high pylon up here, which is a whole lot easier for getting your paddle in and out of. Uh, the console, that's one thing. That, you know, I don't like consoles. Never have. I didn't like it in the other boat. I don't like it in this boat. I've heard some complaints about it. Some people say it's too big. It doesn't bother me because I'm not. it's not in there. The one thing I didn't like is, is having to remove it with tools. Now, I, I, I think I've got a clip of how we did it on Ethan's Thunderstruck, but you have to have tools to get it off. We did leave the bar on his to uh, hang lures on, which was a real good idea by Josh Tidwell, and I, I've got footage of that as well. You know, I loved the Mayfly, and I, and I know people say, well, you, you jump around from boat to boat. Well, guys, boats are a whole lot like females. They've got... Some of them have attributes which are really, really nice, and some of them have things that you, you don't really care about. And then, and then when you find that one that meshes well with everything that you like, you better marry her. And, and, and this, is, this is my everything mesh well boat. Uh, this year in 2018, I'm hoping to hit places that are a little bit more aggressive as far as white water, difficult to get to, pulling things over rocks, you know, carrying boats long distance. Now, the... the Regular, the original Kusa, the OG Kusa, would be probably the best boat for that. But I can't have one of everything. I can have you know a couple, but I can't have one of everything. And so, so this one does what I do most of the time great. And I, this boat is it's, it's fast enough, it's stable enough. If you haven't seen my redfish video where we're standing sight fishing down the reds in uh, Louisiana, shame on you, but go check that out. You'll see. I mean, it does a great job there. You know, stripped down, I can still fly fish out of it real well, so I'm, I'm tickled with that. It, it does maneuverable enough. I mean, I've put it on serious big water and, and, and been pleased with it. As long as I'm in a low in the back position, I'm, I'm maneuverable enough to do what I need to. You know, when I'm getting into some spooky places that I've got to have every bit of maneuverability that I can, this boat's going to answer that for me. Uh, I really like the design. The one thing that I wish is that Jackson would change the seat out to what they've done in the CUDA HD with the slide system. To me, that would be just the ultimate for this boat, and that would make this the perfect boat for me. Uh, but I really like it. I, I went with the Arctic this year because it matches my truck. I thought that was pretty cool. Ethan went with Thunderstruck. He liked that one a whole lot. But, I mean, the, the CUSA HD 2018, not a whole lot of changes other than a few good changes. It's up to you on the console. Like I said, that's not my thing. But I wanted to give you all an explanation of why I'm back in the Coosa HD. I love this boat. I, I, I love every boat I've been in so far. But between this boat and the DT where I can either paddle with my wife or, or, or kids or whatever I need to, uh, somebody else's kids, my kid's old enough to paddle on his own. But th I love that boat as well. But, but these two round out everything that I need. So I've got my fleet established. I just wanted to talk to you all about this one and let you know. Hey, keep up with me on YouTube. Keep up with me on Facebook. Y'all share the love. Show me your pictures. If I can be any help, just, just ask. I'll see what I can do. Y'all take care. Bye now.